All right, the step down modules, as you saw in the previous video, they get a little bit warm as they're doing the stepping down. And um, I've got a couple of fans that's gonna go on the heat sinks controlled by an SMD TM1. And um, I'm sure you know all about that. If not, we got links down in the bottom where you can see what exactly what the TM1 is gonna do. And um, also, I've got 16 volt batteries in the back, a 12 volt battery in the front. When the car is shut off, I don't really want them interacting with each other just because of the fact that the front battery is going to be sitting at a little bit higher of a voltage than I want it to. So I'm basically going to make my own battery isolator and make it to where the front battery connects to the rear only when everything is started and running. The car is off, the 12 volt battery up front won't even be touching the 16s. I generally don't want these step down modules making a bunch of heat and making a bunch of wasted electricity when the car is near being used. So I got an 80 amp relay right here, via air. I use it for stuff like airbags, air suspension on the Tahoe, things like that. And uh, this should be able to carry enough amperage to run a small four channel and the car itself. This is in and I have everything totally separated and actually totally together and totally separated depending on where the key's at. Then I'll be ready to start the new steps which is ripping out the interior, sealing up a bunch of holes, putting a nice fat round over on the port, doing all sorts of little things it takes to gain a couple extra dB. I don't know if I'm gonna gain any dB, I don't know if I'm gonna lose any dB, who knows, but the only thing you could do is go in there and try and see what happens. All right, now knowing that those step down modules are gonna get warm as they're stepping down i'm gonna have to put some fans on them if this car was like something i would drive every day and like my lexus or maybe my ford then maybe i would do something a little bit nicer a little bit more permanent but this is what i came up with to hold the fans on those little heat sinks until then so check it out we're going to turn this into a little fan holder all right now i've only got one hand so i couldn't film and cut at the same time but this thing is cut to size I got all the little bends that need to be done right there marked on the, and I got myself a little break. We're gonna bend it up the way we need it to be. All right, so when the TM1 senses it getting a little warm, fans are gonna kick on, cool those things right down. Be good to go. So now it's time to put the four channel in, hook up some mids and highs, so I can hear what song is being played. And right, keep with on the fans working. in, ready to cool those little step down modules whenever they get warm. I went ahead and got the DC Audio 90.4, little four channel. Even the DGAF needs a four channel, at least in the very minimum, so I can hear what song it's playing for doing demos and stuff. This is gonna be an SPL car, basically gonna have one note that's gonna be harder than all the others, of course. Try to get the best numbers I can, but I'm hoping the single demo some music as well. So I'm gonna drop this 90.4 into its spot, it's all pre-wired but I've also got it pre-planned out to go in that little corner. Been that way for a long time. So I had to make it to where I can pull the amp out, set the gains, and pop it back in with these. And that's what I've done. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it in and go to the next phase. 